what is up guys welcome and welcome back to the channel or the patreon today we are continuing on the percy jackson um tv show series uh, i just want to say if i sound really sick i am <laughs> um on christmas day i had like a scratchy throat prior to that but on christmas day went downhill real fast and your girl has been dying i can't breathe out of my my nose very well <laughs> unfortunately i still have to like do stuff and work and so um if i don't film this now you guys won't see a reaction from me in a in, in a while so <laughs> at least with this series so um i'm jumping on it and filming while i'm sick so that i can just make sure that i'm still keeping up with it otherwise uh-uh it's gonna be at least like two weeks before you see me next <laughs> so as of right now episode three is out um and then i guess i'm waiting on episode four because it only only one episode is um out right now so it's like 8 37 uh p.m my time so we'll see just want to say thank you guys so much for the love on um the first video uh had a blast um i was so excited and i still very much am because like i said like i loved the books and i just remember as a kid being like oh my gosh i love this series <laughs> i was just like i really enjoyed it um and so to see it kind of like in this form uh was really like exciting for me and i'm so excited to continue the series just quickly to clarify uh because i didn't clarify in the first one no spoilers please um i did read the books but i read them in middle school and i don't really remember much i really don't <laughs> so i'm really kind of going into this honestly like like i haven't read the books even though i have like some things may be like i'm they may pop up and i'm like oh my gosh that's right but it's not like i can go into details and recite every single thing you know what i'm saying i didn't watch all the movies but i'm gonna like forget them i know like i compared them a lot to the tv show less video and i think that was just me kind of like taking in all the stuff and like being like okay so this is what this version is going to be which is you know great and like taking in how the characters are coming across compared to how that i'm how much i'm used to the other ones you know but i think i'm just gonna go into this from now on just kind of forgetting the books and the movies which is gonna be extremely hard for me i feel like <laughs> you know what i mean but i'm gonna try my very best i'm gonna forget that i read the books and forget about the movies just to like focus on a tv show um and like whatever the tv show is giving me that's what i will like comment on you know what i'm saying so that's kind of how i'm gonna go about it not because someone told me to but because like i feel like i would enjoy it even more like you know what i mean and be less stressed out about someone coming at me for getting something wrong which i got a lot wrong the other the other video but i do appreciate everybody down below just like explaining things that i had like the questions i had and like helping me out you guys were so sweet appreciate you there's been a lot of people down below too that were so excited that we're doing this so really just looking forward to the rest of this freaking series season one i don't know give me all the seasons green like this let's go <laughs> for me personally i haven't found anything like that has like made me be like concerned or anything i'm just been really enjoying it um the, like i said the only the only thing i was like kind of like iffy on was the cuts to black but i found that it could be a two reasons there's like a ad version of this show so like if you're watching another version of it, it could be because of that but also it's like similar to like the book and how like the chapters and stuff so that could be because of that um and the only thing i said about it was that it was a bit jarring sometimes but other than that not not really much of a big deal so anyways i think that's it once again i'm so sorry that i'm sick but i have to get this out for you guys if i'm talking weird this is because i can't breathe <laughs> out of my nose <laughs> i'm dying i look like a potato and i got some tissues on the side of me in case i gotta blow my nose so we're just gonna go into this i'm excited last place we left off on we're going to hades we're gonna figure out who stole the lightning bolt um even though they're blaming it on percy and he did not steal the lightning bolt so and i'm pretty sure hades didn't either from the books i think i know who did but i'm not gonna say it because i don't want to spoil myself <laughs> like i'm just gonna let it play out so but yeah hades has percy's mom and percy's about to get his mom back period and annabeth and grover are about to join us so it's gonna be a journey let's go let's get it let's go who's capping are we in 
This is kind of creepy, like the way it's being shot right now. It's like, oh no, is this the, um, oh my God, is this the, wait, am I thinking right? Wait, oh my God, I got so excited. Is this like the, what's the word, Oracle or something? Like the, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Hi, I'm Percy. <laughs> His little hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, this is terrifying. I was told a quest isn't a quest until you've said so. Okay. Which is weird, considering your Halloween decoration. Halloween decorations don't do that. They don't do that. You seem busy. I'll come back. <laughs> right. <laughs> you shall find what was stolen and see it safely return. Huh. Let's go. I have selected our most compelling candidates from which you will choose two to join you on this quest. Okay, so we're choosing. That we succeed. Annabeth. Period. One ways to at least hear a name or two before choosing. Are you sure you don't want to hear more? Nope. Now on to the other candidates. Yeah. Honestly, if I was personally, I would have done the same thing. Dang, they got Grover out here shoveling justice for my man. They be doing Grover kind of petty. I ain't gonna lie. So, who'd you choose to go with you? You, bestie? Come on. You. Yeah! <laughs> Percy a real one. Percy a real one. You shall be betrayed. Oh. I forgot. I trust you. I'm gonna pack the best snacks. <laughs> I love Grover. <laughs> I love Grover. I brought you this. It's the uh shoes, right? The shoes? Yeah. Maya. That is so dope. Just take care of each other out there. Yeah. She's really gonna miss that tree, huh? When Annabeth first arrived here with Thali and Luke, they were being chased by monsters. Agents That's right, she became a tree, right? Thali had turned back to fight to buy her friends some time. Yeah. Later protector tried to stop her, but she wouldn't listen. Zeus intervened to save her life and changed her form. Hey. She oh. fought valiantly and she met a hero's fate. She met a pine cone's fate. Don't, don't, Percy, stop playing. And you? are not Thalia. Do exactly as I say, and maybe you survive this. Are we clear? Oh, Annabeth said, I stand on business. Oh, shoot. Does she think she's in charge? Well. Who do you think would be in charge? Right. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go get us some snacks. I'll come with you. No, you'll stay right there. Monsters can't smell you through that. So that's where I want you. I wanna vote. I want to vote. There's no voting. Chips and sodas okay for you guys? I don't think you should just get to decide we don't vote. Over, please. Can you help your... Grover just like... Friend. I really don't want to be a tiebreaker. <laughs> oh, golly. The road's getting bumpy because I got me some friends who just can't get along. Oh, dear. It's a consensus song. Verse 2 encourages us to say nice things about each other. Grover. That's... Time and place. I just... <laughs> Chips and sodas okay for you guys? Whatever. Yes, please. <clears throat> Don't judge. Don't judge. Oh. Who is that? She looks suspicious. I know you felt that, Annabeth. Child of the big three. Zeus, <sighs> Poseidon, and Hades is at the most extreme risk. I smell fear. That's bees. Oh! That's bees. It's important to remember that if you've ever got to confront one. Whoa! Wherever your armor is weakest, that monster is probably coming right for it. Oh! Nothing will stop them. Oh, here we go, y'all. Here we go. Here we go. If you guys were better at your job, <clears throat> I might not have noticed you here so easily. If Thalia were better at hers, there might not be a family of squirrels making her their home. Oh! <laughs> you better speak! 
Adalia. You hear me? Oh, I will jump right through that screen and start boxing. Mess her up, Annabeth. Mess her up. Oh, she think, uh -huh. she thinks she funny. She thinks she, ah, oh, mess her up. Oh, dang. Annabeth really confronted her too. She was like, what are you doing? I see you, period. Queen, oh my God. You picked the wrong one today. Okay. Uh-uh, we better not let that slide, Annabeth. We gonna have to get her. Uh-uh. She thought she was slick with that. Is that why Haiti sent you here? To gloat over a job you almost did right once? Ha! <laughs> Gagger! I'm here to collect your friend. Collect them? For what? No, oh, I don't question orders. Bring him in quick and quiet. That is what I was told. Well, you gonna fail. I don't think these windows really? are supposed to- Oh my god. On the bus! On the bus! Another? Whoa! Percy, we gotta go. Stop playing. Come on. All right. Well, so far so good. I feel like nobody died. That's that's a good thing. What do we need a phone for? So we can call Cam? It's supposed to be hard. That's why only certain people are chosen. If we call Cam, we're basically saying it was a mistake to choose us. I mean, I'm completely comfortable with that. Percy, bro. <laughs> Just a kid doesn't do what you did to Clarice back at camp. Just a kid doesn't have Haiti sending top lieutenants to retrieve them. You know, you are part of something so much bigger than we can understand right now. You and your mother seem close, so why don't we ask her for help? Grover, will you explain to your friend that he needs to pull himself together? Shush. Okay, what we smelling? What we smelling? What we smell? Hamburgers. Hamburgers? Why would hamburgers be in the forest? Okay. We got a lot of we got a lot of stuff to deal with. We just started it. Everybody Whoever it is. They're from our world. Okay, but maybe we should be a little cautious going up to them. Oh, are we about to go into Medusa? Oh my god, here we go. That's not good, right? <laughs> Let's go. I'm so excited. Oh. Rover, you walked us into a trap. <laughs> Not today, friends. Not on my doorstep. Oh, you come have on. something to resolve. Why not come inside and I'll help? We ain't going in there. She won't bother you as long as you're with me. But it isn't as though she'll leave either. Not if it means reporting that she failed <coughs> to retrieve the son of Poseidon. How did you? It's probably out by now. Yeah. It's a pleasure to meet you, son of Poseidon. I'm Medusa. Oh, I got chills. Oh, man. So I'm going in. You guys. I don't know. <laughs> what you want? We are not a team right now, okay? What are you? We need to be a team. I mean, I knew we wasn't going to be a team off the bat, but wow, we are really not a team. You're concerned I would hold a grudge against you simply because you are a daughter of Athena? Please, sit and eat. Oh, bro, she's so creepy. What my mother did to you wasn't a gift. It was a curse. Uh. You know the story of how I came to be this way? I do. Do you? like how this feels like i'm scared <laughs> i worshipped her i prayed to her i made offerings i wasn't like you sweetheart Ooh. i was you Ooh. but then one day another god came and he broke that silence your father the sea god told me that he loved me oh huh but then athena declared that i had embarrassed her and i needed to be punished decided that I would never be seen again by anyone who would live to tell the tale. I ain't gonna lie, Athena, that's kind of messed up. That isn't what happened. My mother is just. Not all gods, gods are just doing some messed up stuff. They want us to blame ourselves for their own shortcomings. That is not what happened. And you are a liar. Uh. Something's burning. <laughs> would you give me a hand in the kitchen? I think lunch is ready. I could 
uh uh you could help stop you remove them from the equation yo percy let's go <laughs> he ran that's why that's that's exactly oh shit okay but do so don't do nothing crazy though okay oh here we go 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 let me see let me see let me see oh her eyes <laughs> whoa 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 oh my god she got a whole city down here a hotel people just people here's the plan i'll get in the air i'll draw her attention as soon as you hear me say maya you guys start to oh. ah, off down <laughs> grover <laughs> we are not our parents until we choose to be you two have chosen oh this is scary as hell let's have a look at you here we go here we go here we go Whoa. Wow, that was fast. But good teamwork. We did good teamwork that time. Make sure it's pointing in the right direction before you take my hat off. Yo! <laughs> Grower. Oh no, that's right. Yeah. What is it? He found one of his relatives, I think. Uncle Ferdinand. Yeah. Oh no. This is as far as he got on his quest. We aren't even to Trenton. But look at him. Oh, Grover! Oh, uh, we probably should get going. It'll be dark soon. But what are we gonna do with the head? I say we keep it. What are you actually doing on this quest? And why do I have to hear about this from Medusa? Okay, while we're at it, you should have accepted my offer. Why are you talking like this? Because all day he I've been up. trying to keep this quest on track without upsetting either of you. Right. Come on, Grover. You've been fighting with her. You've been fighting with me. Because the Oracle said one of you would betray me. Okay? I forgot about that, Loki. I ain't gonna lie. So... You shall be betrayed by one who calls you a friend. Oh my god, it just jumped right back in my head as soon as I forgot. I know who did it. I think so. I'm not gonna say anything because I don't want to be wrong and I don't want you guys to spoil me down below. But I think I remember everything now. Oh, but that's going to be a... Okay, I'm not going to say nothing else. Uh, it just jumped right back out. Okay, okay. I got it. I got it. I chose her because I couldn't imagine we'd ever be friends. And I chose you because I thought if I can count on anyone to be on my side, no matter what, it was you. And now I'm feeling so alone. I don't know what to think or who to trust. Yeah, Percy been through it. You didn't choose to be demigods. Right, girl, we're right. We didn't choose this quest. Right, right. We can decide that as long as the three of us are together, none of us are going to be alone. Let's go. We, need, we needed this so that we could be a team. Okay. Hermes Express, she ships these things all over. Like batteries, you just send them back where they came from. Uh. Okay, look, this is a bad idea. We will see this as impertinent. Damn, yeah, impertinent. Yeah. <laughs> this way. Part of your mom's still with us. Yeah. Thank you. So this isn't exactly what I meant by choosing each other. I mean, you did a good job, Grover. It's okay. We'll get there. <laughs> You're going to sing the song, aren't you? I'm so done. Okay. Oh, golly. The road's getting Whatever. bumpy. Consensus. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, are we about to see Olympus right now? Oh my god! With best wishes, Percy Jackson. <laughs> oh, shut up! I'm freaking dead. <laughs> I did not expect to see him in this. You guys are not gonna believe this. Oh man. So obviously, like at the end of the episodes, they kind of tease the next one. I thought it was more so like an end scene, but it's literally like showing you what happens next. And even though like it doesn't really spoil much, I want to still be super surprised and not be, you know, like expecting stuff. 
because I knew a Medusa was going to show up in this one. So um, I'm just going to go. I'm not going to watch that. Okay. Lots to think here with this one. Um, I think Medusa kind of brought up some good points to Loki about like you choose who you are. I don't remember Medusa's backstory. And so this was, was a refresh for me. But it really kind of gave her some like substance she wasn't just this monster she was more to that even though she was still a monster in a way but like she had reasons her own reasons as to why and and, and you know so i thought that was really interesting for me i also think it was really cool to see the friendship between Grover, Annabeth, and Percy. Annabeth and Percy off the bat, like we really fighting. Like besties, like we not besties yet. We just, we just, you know, like, you know what I mean? Um, So we just, we really not vibing like that. And I've been kind of feeling bad for Grover in this series so far, because like he really is trying to do the best he can, but he keeps failing and it, it, it hurts him. It hurts him, you know? and it sucks and he keeps getting like the short end of the stick on things sometimes um but he's trying his best right and so he's sitting there in the middle of both of them fighting and being like okay we gotta pull it together <laughs> like you doing this you doing that we need to be a team otherwise we are not about to make this like period so i really love that like he kind of grew a backbone in that moment and was like listen up people whatever we need to figure out we need to figure it out fast because we cannot keep going like this like i really feel like as a character i really love that moment that he did um and he didn't allow them to walk over him because sometimes he kind of allows people to walk over him a little bit you know but then again like this was the first time he kind of showed the backbone like him telling percy about his his mom was also a moment too you know annabeth is so closed off like which she has reason to be she has reasons to be, uh, especially when they talked about Luke and Ta Dahlia. But like, she's so cold to Percy. Well, not maybe super cold, but just like she has her walls up to him. And he's like, bruh. <laughs> I thought it was interesting that Percy kind of like knew, you know, like how he was going to go about choosing who was going to be on the team with them. He was like, I know when push comes to shove rover you're my friend i can trust you and with annabeth if something happened and she you know decided to you know do something grover would have his back but he still chose annabeth because i think he knows obviously annabeth is like one of the strongest you know like fighters it on camp it would it wouldn't make sense to not pick her but also he knows about her wanting to be on the quest, right? But since he got that, you know, message from the Oracle, I think he was trying to cover bases, thinking one of them would betray him. But I would just say this about it. I don't think this is a spoiler, but if you're someone that has not read the books or read uh, or watched the movies, I would just say maybe a spoiler warning. I'm not gonna say who it is, but like, I just get past this part. <laughs> but I don't think it was Grover or Annabeth that betrayed him, if I remember correctly. I don't think so but also don't say anything in the comments below okay i did feel like in this episode it did start to move kind of fast uh like i was like okay we already killed medusa like we're moving kind of fast you know ideally i would like to spend more time with medusa because i kind of was really interested in her character and how they filmed that whole thing like being in her house and like seeing all the statues that was so like they really kind of made it really horror based and i was like bro also see the oracle for the first time was really cool as soon as we were in that it's like a, is it an attic that he's in as soon as we were there i was like oh my god that's right the oracle i totally forgot about this prophecy all this stuff but i think this episode does a really good job at uh building their friendship between annabeth grover and percy and showing us more of the world of you know what we're walking into in that way um i do know like i said this is going to be eight episodes so they they are going to have to jam pack things and it's not going to be perfect by any means but i still feel like this is so good i don't know it could just be me i i still feel like this is really really good sometimes i don't know why it shocks me but i actually really like that it is because i don't know if i just if like the movies just like kind of like poisons my mind to think it's kind of just funny i really like 
how serious tone this TV show is, which could be reflective, obviously, of the book. But I really do like how serious it feels sometimes. Like sometimes, like when Percy's talking, like I just want to cry because like he just he's so like frustrated and confused. But like he has to set out and do this like almost impossible quest and figure it out you know like that would make me so anxious you know and he's like 12 so <laughs> you know like I, I i i would be so depressed and in anxiety all the time just with like how things are going um so sometimes when he's talking about you know being scared and not knowing who to trust like it's a real thing and there is real loss in the TV series, just as there is in the book and stuff. Like, there's like real consequences, I think. So there, ha they, it has some like weight to it, like how you know losing Thalia has affected Annabeth and Luke in some way. You know how Grover seeing his uncle, how that affects him. You like, he, there is loss, right? So I actually really appreciate how, yes, we do have some funny moments, but it is quite serious. And I think that this tone that this show has taken so far has really done the serious moments really well. I'm excited to see like the what what happens with the uh, like Medusa's head being sent to uh up there. I don't think it I don't think anything good comes from it, if I can remember. But I think that was a good good episode. So sorry that I sounded like I don't know what during this, but I hope you guys still enjoyed the reaction nonetheless. And uh yeah, I will see y'all on the next one.